So this is the best idea I've ever had, ever? Second. Oh, it's my first best idea. Oh, yeah. That's a nice long row of shops yeah. and restaurants. It's more, uh, I think it's all around Bath the lake. Bath shop. Say it again, that's adorable. And <laughs> and Episcopal. There it is. Episcopal. There it is. I love yeah, when you figure it out on your own. So we're heading to White Face Mountain and it's in the town next door. Yeah. They say it's one of the best views. So the guy that gave us directions to the White Face Mountain also said that this is probably the last week that it'll be open start snowing it'll snow by the end of October and we're here the first week in October so we caught it at just the right time buddy Okay, so we just made it to the toll booth for the the Whiteface Lake Placid Mountain. And if you are a veteran, like Wani, then you, it's normally, what'd she say? 40, 40. It's, usually, it's usually $40, so $20 a, a person. And then, so we got it for $25 for both of us. Yeah. So that was nice. And it is Veterans Memorial Highway. So I'm glad we asked. So we're in and we're heading up the mountain. Hey guys, check this out. There's already ice forming on the rocks. And then this is the Castle Summit. We're going to head in there. I think there's a gift shop. No, I love a gift shop. Climbing, you keep climbing, and you'll end up there. But I don't think Juan's a big fan of heights, and I don't blame him. So I think I'll have to stop down here. It's 27 stories. Okay, so if you want to, you can take the, an elevator to the summit. Or you can take the stairs that I just showed you. If you need an elevator, there's that option. You want me to go that way and take pictures? Okay, all right, all right. Okay, so I don't know about this. We are, this is the other way to the summit and we're going through the mountain. So I'm not sure what's on the other side, but we'll know soon enough. Okay, so here's the, here's the summit.
So the elevator line is long and takes a little while. So I'm just gonna take, I'm just gonna go down the, go down the stairs. So it is note worthy. And it's a little bit uneven. It's not stairs, it's just rocks. And it has side rails, handrails. But it's a little bit like a mountain trek. I actually like this a lot. And then every so often look up. So we are spending the night at the East Wind Hotel. Oh, look at that reception, lounge and bar. That might be where we want to be. Okay, so the, the bonfire will be lit up later. This is the reception, they have a bar there. There's bikes you can ride. Juan wants to get in here, so let's do that now. Okay, all right. That'd be nice, very nice. Oh, I had, I was trying to, I had booked the one with the, um, the chessboard. I don't see a chessboard. This is very nice. And does it have a, um, Wi-Fi? Yeah, it does have Wi-Fi. So this area has a sauna. Let's all look at that. Okay, dinner tonight. Purple Sage Bistro. Adorable. Have a friend who loves purple. <laughs> I'm talking about you. So I gave Juan a break from videoing dinner, but it was great and we would definitely go back. Alright, so we got a little reception area. Hello. Okay, so I just found out that this place has s'mores. S'mores. Okay, so I'm just going to show you. And then we're going to take it out there and we're going to make it happen. What a great way to end a great overnight stay at Lake Placid. Am I right? I gave Juan a pass for dinner to not video. So just know that it was a lovely dinner and we loved the place and we would definitely go back again. Something we really liked afterwards was the fire that was outside.